the world of country music and well beyond the world of country music, the world of music as a whole has been uh, very cognizant of your contributions. There was this moment in Nashville when you were able to sing Amazing Grace. Yeah. yeah. Tell me about that. How loud? Good. That was, that was uh, Mr. Rather, that was um, at the Country Music Hall of Fame yeah. induction. And it was a song that, of course, had always been so special to him. One of his last um, public appearances was at George Jones' funeral, and he sang Amazing Grace. Mm -hmm. When we were in physical therapy and occupational and speech therapy, uh, we went for two and a half years after we finally got out of the hospital after five and a half months. But that's where... Uh, a little girl named Tracy who had a music degree, she would come in on her lunch hour, bring her keyboard, and started teaching mm. Randy uh, melody and song again. And so she started teaching him Amazing Grace. And the words from his memory bank up in, up in, his, in his brain, which was the unaffected side, the words all came back to him. It was just a matter of the aphasia um, and forming the words that was the challenge. So we just spent, we spent, spent about two months on just the letter uh, A. Yeah. But when we got A down, then the next letters and vowels seemed to come exponentially. We spent probably six hours a day running through that song, trying mm -hmm. to get through all four verses and learning the words. I asked him, uh, probably about 30 minutes before the induction started, I said, honey, do you feel comfortable doing it? Because after my speech, I was going to introduce him and um, give country music back mm -hmm. the voice of Randy Travis if he felt good about it. And he looked at me and he said, yep. <laughs> and so that's, and nobody knew we were going to do it. And I think when I put that microphone in his hand, he just became Randy mm -hmm. Travis again. It was absolutely beautiful. So it took everybody by surprise in the place because nobody knew that he knew it or could mm -hmm. do it. And it was the first time he had ever sang a note in public yeah. um, since the stroke. So that was three years prior. And um, it, I think there wasn't many dry eyes in the place. It was beautiful. Mm -hmm. 